All right, trying out a um, kind of fun little experiment here today with the, I guess we could even call it a science project. Um, what you see here is a Mora knife companion, an extremely popular uh, knife in the um, bushcraft and uh, kind of sur survival um, communities. It uh, can be had regularly for probably the $17 range on Amazon. Um, they do have sales every once in a while. I, I'm, I know I got uh, mine on sale for like $9.99 um, a year or two ago. Um, and, uh, you know, I, I use it a little bit. Um, it's not uh, my main carry blade. It's, uh, it's very thin. I don't even know... Um, what the measurements are on that. Um, probably uh, 330 seconds of an inch or something, maybe in more. It's definitely not up in the eighth of an inch thickness range like a lot of bushcraft knives are, but it's got that, that uh, Scandinavian grind. It is very, very sharp, uh, made in Sweden. Um, this, they, they come in both uh, stainless steel and uh, high carbon steel blades. This is the carbon steel version. Um, it is, uh, for the most part, still uh, pretty polished. There is some uh, spots of patina on the blade, but uh, what we are going to do is um, kind of put uh, a force patina on uh, the entire blade. Um, have a, um, I'm uh, using instructions that I got in a video from Black Scout Survival. We are going to use some uh, white vinegar and saturate this uh, paper towel with it, then uh, wrap the uh, knife blade in the paper towel, and then wrap it all in this uh, aluminum foil. So let's see how it goes. And uh, he said in uh, his video um, to uh, just let it sit in this um, vinegar for half an hour or so, then um, unwrap it and uh, see what it looks like. So hopefully uh, get this in the frame, got my my towel soaked up. This, uh, this knife blade isn't uh, very big, four inches, and as I said, very thin. So we're just going to wrap it up in this towel. sure I got it uh, fully covered there and then we will wrap that in this aluminum foil and I'll set a timer for half an hour and then uh, we'll come back alrighty 30 minutes has passed so let's uh, see what we got here. Pretty cool. Kind of a cool pattern there. Flip it over. I like it. I I like it. Um, so nice, neat little. Um, <clears throat> Science project and uh, you know patina will help um, prevent further rust on the blade going forward. Um, I've even seen um, some videos elsewhere here on the tube of uh, some guys doing this uh, vinegar portion and afterwards putting um, yellow mustard, which you know uh, can also contains a lot of vinegar in it, um, and kind of putting a pattern on the blade with the mustard, um, but uh, I think uh, this looks nice just like this. So if, uh, <clears throat> if you have an uncoated high carbon steel blade, maybe you can try something like this at home and uh, maybe I'll try it again with uh, some other knives in the future. But uh, yeah, this was a cool little project and uh, I like I like how it turned out. All right. Catch you later.